so, <laughs> so I guess we're adding that in. If you if you've never been and want mm -hmm. to go, tell us uh, in 50 words or less what you would do at a at a Cubs game. Mm -hmm. I get a feeling most of our stories are going to be coming from uh, people in the bleachers. Uh, that would probably be, be a safe Good bet. Good point. Yeah, that's a place to be. Time now, 7.45, and coming up, we will listen once again to the reggae band Roots Rock Society. They sounded great this yeah. morning. Warming up? That's great. It's great on Fridays because as you're, you know, you're getting prepared for the show, you've got some music. That's right. The show needs a little funk, you know? It needs, a right. little, it needs, it needs some, uh, a little hipness. That's right. We had the aphrodisiacs yesterday, and now these guys. Welcome back. We've been listening to the reggae music of Roots Rock Society, and I am joined by Stan. Thanks for joining us this morning. Hey, we're glad to be here. It's fun. And you're, you based, you're based in Chicago? Yes, yes. And can you introduce the band for us? First of all, this is Mandingo. Mm -hmm. This is Steve Verde. Hey. Haish Zakim. Mm -hmm. And Youth Man Daniel. All right. And uh, tell us, you, you do some uh, educational workshops, is that right? Yeah, we've been doing a lot of them in Indiana and Iowa, and we hope to do some in Chicago now because we want to make sure that children learn about the roots of the music because they don't have much to do and they need to learn some things and get them off the streets. What, what do you teach them? All different kinds of music? How to play or just? Well, we teach them, you know, how the, the drums are made, how the guitar is made, uh, the history of the guitar, how it came from Africa into Spain and from Spain into the Americas. And, mm -hmm. and of course, the drum is the symbol of kings, and that's part of our logo. So. Now you don't, you don't, you play your own music. When you go to a concert and people start yelling out, hey, play Bob Marley or something, you, you don't do that kind of thing. Well, we try not to because we knew Bob and that Bob always stressed to us that we play your stuff, play your original stuff. And that's what we've been doing for a long time. It's been working out pretty well. We're on the charts and everything's okay. And now tell us about your latest CD called Again. Right, right. Uh, it's been doing pretty well. You know, we're getting a lot of email from people internationally and everything. It's, it's, it's a wonderful thing. Larry. You haven't heard it? I ha oh, I've been listening to you. I'd rather hear it live. And we've got the, uh, you've got quite a big fan club, so we've got an email address for you out there, if we can show that. Can we show the email address? Because I just don't know it off the top of my head. There it is. And you know, I don't know anything about computers, do you? Well, I know they're a big help. I don't know much <laughs> okay. about them. Okay. <laughs> what song are we going to hear this morning? Uh, this is one from the release, um, Roots Romance. Okay. And do you, do you write the, do you, do you Write them yourself? Or oh, yeah, them? yeah. This has been written uh, about 10 years ago. It's an old song, but it's still a nice version. All right. Thanks for joining us this morning. Sounds great. Thank you. Stick to 